Paris. Well, yeah, that's right. <laughs> well, from bears to deer, people come from all over the world just to experience our wildlife. But if you've ever tried to do this, you know that actually getting a good picture of them, it can be tricky. It can be tricky, but our Sevier County Bureau Chief <laughs> Kyle Granger has tips from a pro. So this is in Cades Cove. Um, this uh, mom actually had four cubs, but one was higher in the tree and uh, pretty much blocked by some of the leaf uh, and foliage. So I concentrated on the three. After retirement, Barry Spruce took on a hobby he'd loved since childhood, photography. Take a look around his gallery and you can see just how he's captured the moments of nature in the Great Smoky Mountains. And the black bear is a big hit. So they all have a certain range and then getting the idea of what they like to do, when they like to do it. Um, and then, you know, the age, once you know the age of the bear too, you, you tend to fall into uh, knowing what, they, what they're gonna do year in and year out. Because you'll stay a good distance away, he suggests a long range lens. And there are great places all over the Smokies to see wildlife. But that picture perfect moment could take hours, if not days to capture. Cades Cove gives you just about everything. Um, Roaring Fork uh, has some really good uh, seasons, um, but uh, Cades Cove has a little bit of everything because we do have fields and woods and berries and uh, different things that they eat. He says it takes time to learn the bears' habits, where and when they'll feed, and when they might just play around in the meadow. The best thing I can say is to spend time with a bear. Once you find a bear, is to stay your distance, but to let it be natural. So when you let something be natural, that's when you get the best photography. Good luck with your photos. Kyle Granger, WVLT News.